Good evening, everyone. My name is Heath Haskins, Good Primate, and welcome back to another Lumber Tycoon 2 video. And I realized something. I know that I've been doing 15 minute videos, trying to make them really fast throughout the entire week. I just realized something whenever I was going through on uh, yesterday's. I've got no oak wood. <laughs> I mean, I've got enough to like build some little things, but the entire area is just full of oak wood, and I've been neglecting to go and get it. So. That's what we're going to do. We're going to go get a lot of oak wood, throw it in there. Hopefully, uh, actually, should I turn it down to the one by ones? I know I had it turned up. Oh, wait, is this oak? Hold up. Hold on. Let's see if this is oak. If this is oak, then I'll just, I'll throw those in there and be done with it. Maybe we're doing oak. Maybe we're not. I don't know. Hold on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Let's go. This might be elm. Did I make two different significance of elm and oak for the thing? I don't know if I did. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oak tree. That is not oak. Elm. Elm tree? No. It's cherry. Elm? Elm tree. Okay. So that's an elm tree. And there's a piece of zombie wood down there. And what? What are you doing here, sir? Um, well, get this to stand up, but you know what, you know what, I don't care, I don't care. <laughs> um, let's go get some oak trees. And that's funny, because, like, oak trees are the most common. They're, they're what you start with, and I neglected them. I'm so sorry, my little oak tree. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just kidding. Just kidding. What? <laughs> <laughs> it didn't even fall down. It didn't even phase it. It's like, you can't chop me. What are you thinking? Now, I'm not going to worry about these these pieces. I am going to worry about these pieces. The the little end pieces, we're just going to, to leave. They're not significant enough to build uh, big pieces like I'm wanting. I know that sounds cruel, but, you know. Hey, by the way, um, hashtags uh, Team Trees. Has anybody gotten their t-shirts on those? Because, I mean, I signed up for it and, and did the video thingy, and I don't remember... I remember filling out the form and giving them my address, but I haven't gotten a t-shirt yet. I figure they're just, like, really far behind, especially with, like, corona going on and everything else. So, I don't know. I just keep going. Just keep going. Alright. Uh, we... Uh, a lot of people have been asking, hey, Code, what's the significant thing? Why are you making 15-minute videos? I can't answer you. I'm sorry. Uh, it's it's secretive at the moment. But um, I can say core is something that I'm going to be doing. Okay? And, in fact, I, I'm, I think I might have made some videos this week on it. Maybe? I don't know. I don't know at this particular point in time. But... Core is this awesome game that basically kind of has the same idea as Roblox. It's not the same, okay? Uh, you cannot do custom uploads and, and a lot of the creativity part that you can do inside Roblox, but it's got a better engine. It has got a significantly better uh, gaming engine. It uses Unreal. Which uh, might be a problem with the Apple Store if the epic Unreal Engine Apple Store thing keeps going on. For those of you that weren't keeping up with it, um, Epic put code into Fortnite that allowed them to bypass the 30% uh, charge by forcing people to purchase through the Apple Store or through the App Store. That is against their terms and conditions, and they went after them. And when they did, uh, there was a big uproar about it. So they said, you know what? We're going to sue you. We're, we're, we're going to come after you. Epic did. Epic said that's not, you can't do that. So they also put a cease and desist order on it. Uh, by the way, I'm not a lawyer. I do not practice law. I'm only stating the things that I've seen on YouTube, in my opinion. What are you? You are a bug. Why is there a bug? It's autumn time. There's bugs out. Well, it's, it's still summer. I mean, I don't want to kill summer before it's over. 
Uh, oh, by the way, people are starting to get, like, kids are going back to school this week, right? Right? I hope you've done your homework. Uh, even if you're doing the homeschool or the launch programs or the Canvas, whatever the case may be, um, make sure you are turning in your homework, talking to your teachers, and just, you know, do all the stuff that you need to before you uh, jump on here to watch one of my videos. Uh, I, w I don't want to be the cause of you missing an assignment or getting a bad grade. In fact, we could probably do some math. Anybody got math problems that you want me to figure out inside Lumber? You'd be like, Code, what's the answer to 47? I'd be like, B, circle it. <laughs> Send me your math homework <laughs> in the comments down below. Just tell me what to solve. <laughs> Oh gosh, we're at six minutes, and I, I, I think I'm going to have a significant amount of uh, oak wood by the time this is over, so that's going to be good. Whoa, whoa. There it goes, there it goes. A lot of you are like, Code, what are you doing? Um, so... A cool little property about the conveyor belts is if they're touching something, um, they turn whatever they're touching into a conveyor belt, kind of. So that's that's what I'm doing. Is I'm, oops, I'm turning the uh, the truck itself into a conveyor belt, and it could be the the momentum of the truck thinking that it's going backwards or saying, "Hey, I've got a speed of negative." X or whatever it's called, whatever velocity it's supposed to be going, and it's getting stopped, so anything that's in the bed of the truck is trying to compensate and be like, oh, I'm supposed to be moving backwards. Could be. Could be. I don't know if that's true or not. I don't know why it's a bug, but it's a bug, and we're going to use it. Okay, that should, uh, that should do for now, I think. Well, let's do a couple more. Why not? It's going to be Oak Tree Friday, or Oak Tree Wednesday. What, what day is this? Monday? Is this Monday, Wednesday, or Friday? I don't know. Whatever day I do uh, Lumber on. Whatever day this is recorded and released on. And it could be any day. Who knows? By the way, um, have you been watching this week? Because uh, all of the videos are 15 minutes, uh, which seems really fast, and it feels like... These are getting done a lot faster than I'm supposed to be having them done. But, did you notice on each one, it was recorded and uploaded on the same day? Okay, okay, so I have to be honest here. How many of you thought that these were recorded on different days? Did you, did you think that I recorded this on a different day? Because, just so you know, yesterday's, uh, yesterday's shirt, or Wednesday's shirt, is right here. And then uh, Monday's Monday's shirt, Monday shirt was right, right here. This is this is what's known as a, a YouTuber trick, where you actually have a wardrobe change, and then record your next episode. Um, if you're getting into YouTube and you have a day specifically that you can do everything, uh, what you'll want to do is a wardrobe change. So you'll record one video, and then at the end of it. You'll say, thanks for watching, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, stop recording, change out shirts, and then start recording your next episode and be like, hey, good evening everyone, welcome back to... Pretty, pretty slick, huh? So. It, feel, it felt kind of devious, it felt deceptive, but I want to be honest about my deception. <laughs> I want to be, I want to be honest about my deception. I want, yeah, that's what it is. I just wanted to be honest and open about why, why I was able to get all these videos done so quickly and the significance behind them and the reason why. The reason why is because every night this week I have got something to do and I won't have time to record and upload and everything else. So, well, <laughs> the week that has already passed because this, this one should be released on... Friday, I think. Okay, that's not good. Oh gosh, are all the oaks doing that? They are. Aren't they? Okay, okay. Here, let's uh, let's jump up here. Oh, oh. 
Jump up here. Can I do a move? Jump up here. Jump up here. Oh, come on. Come on. Jump. Woo. Hit B. There we go. So, let's go ahead and just, uh, yeah, that's not going to work. So, let's do this for now. Whoa, get back here, sir. I didn't say you could go anywhere. What I'm going to do is I'm basically going to trip this one up and make it stay on. Because I don't plan on doing any other kinds of woods for a second. Just a second. Whee. Come on. Oh, no, 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 no. Come on. Ugh. There we go. Wait, did it stay? It didn't stay. Oh, gosh. Hold on. Can I get it to balance? That's the key. If I, oh, gosh. Oh, jeez. There we go. Uh, let's do that. Let's... <gasps> Dang it. Why is this doing this to me? Oh, we're at 11 minutes. I only got four minutes left. I got four minutes to fi figure out. You know what I can do? I can just do this. I'll just drop this in. And then we can unconnect this one. Like this. That way it's off. Then we'll just turn this on. You know? Now, what would be idea is if I had a switch for on off. So that way, if it were this or this, it would be turned on. Do I have an or switch anywhere? Let's go see if I got some logic. Boop, boop. I think I've got logic somewhere, right? Isn't there some logic here somewhere? There's a switch. I've got no uh, or logic. Got lots of wires. Hey, 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 it's the wires, always just wiring around. Oh, oh, wait, I need to go do something right now. There has been a change, and there has been a significant change. Jingle 12, I am giving you uh, a second chance here. We need to go and do this because I was told something. I don't know if it's true or not, but apparently the Maniacs now rest on a shelf. The Maniacs rest on a shelf. It no longer drops down and falls into the ground. or It no longer falls out. That's what I've been told. That's what I'm going to go check. Debunk myth, myths defied unmithers on this episode of Lumber Tycoon 2. I've got like two minutes to do this. No, I've got a minute. No, I got two minutes. That's fine. Okay. So. The only way I'm going to be able to do this is if I can get underneath the ground somehow. Which we're going to do like this. Uh, let's get out the below prints. Alright. And for those of you that don't know, I know how to glitch with the blueprints. So we're just going to rotate in here. Come on. Come on. There we go. And then I should be able to rotate down, right? Hold on, let's rotate one more time up here. There we go. <laughs> no, I don't want to turn this way. I want to turn the other way and then turn into the ground. Right? Right? Is that right? Let's do let's do three turns. Or four turns. And then let's go into the ground. Ready? Here we go. Well, somebody lied to me. Because it's still falling. That's the Maniacs right there. For those of you that don't know, that's the Maniacs. Uh, it looks like the hole down into the maze is still here. The maze is completely gone. It's been, it's been put away into a different folder somewhere, so we've got no way of getting to it. Uh, now I should be able to do a turn right here. Can I do a rotate? Ooh, ooh, code. Be careful, dude. Be careful. Um, can I do a rotate like this? Oh, I saved it. <laughs> Not very well, but 
I did it. There we go. Rotate, rotate. Uh, if I do a turn, turn, turn. Come on, turn, turn, one more time. Please, turn. Oh, turn, turn, turn. Oh gosh. Oh, that's a that's a bad bad deal. Bad deal. Hold on. Let's do another turn. Oh. Oh, I'm underwater right there. Why is the water? Huh. It registers as water. Okay. Okay. I guess. Whee! <laughs> uh, oh, that's all the time I've got time for. That's all the time I got. So, I hope you've enjoyed these couple of little missions, these fast little episodes of me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Do all those cool things I'm supposed to call out at the end of the videos. Love you guys very much. Have a great weekend or day or night or, or morning or whatever the time is. I love you guys. Have a great night. We'll talk to you soon.